Okay, so jumping right back into it. This is episode four. At the end of the last episode, Okabe was confronted very directly by Maho with the fact that Karisu's dead. And he kind of had like a break, a PTSD event. He's kind of freaking out right now on the roof. And um, also, at the end of that episode, uh, Mayuri kind of overheard his conversation with the AI, and she's kind of hurt that he's not sharing it with her. I think that's what's going on. So, let's go. We're almost in there, my garrison. Keep it moving. <laughs> Wait, is this the future? Is this 2036? And is he dreaming, or is this like a flash forward? Wait, it's fine! Run! Ooh. This is, this is what he thinks about, like... In any case, we were damn lucky to get you to the base alive and well, Mr. Okabe. Hold on. Where exactly am I? What happened to my friends? What's going on here? He's not older. He's wearing the same. He's wearing the same thing he was wearing at the party. Is this reading Steiner, or is he just freaking out, or is it a combination? Anymore? When does World War Three start? Hmm. Nani, are you all right? This feeling, I know it well. What? Was I just reading Steiner? Was he in that office? Was he in that futon? Or was he here? Your lap, dummy. What's wrong with you? You left the Christmas party. Hey, come on! Oh, yeah, I left mm. her. How could I? Yeah. Oh no! Fire! Yeah, he's he's having a break. But oh no, 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 no. Ah, oh. he's flashing back to all those times she died. Oh man. There you are, Okri. When Maho comes back, then we can start the present exchange. And she acts like nothing's wrong, even though she was clearly upset when she figured out he was talking to a girl on his phone. She's too good. She doesn't want him to know that she's sad about it. We're still talking. Sure. But you called me back immediately and apologized. Don't you remember? No. Wait. I called her right back. Why do I have no recollection of that? No, he ran straight downstairs. Sorry, we kept you waiting. We were on a call from America and the connection was awful. I think they had a weak signal. It took much longer than expected. Maho and I are both very sorry for keeping you out so late and on Christmas Eve to boot. Apologies. No worries. You took us to a party and we repay you by making you wait. Those crayons you got are adorable, Professor. What? So he, he had a PTSD incident, but he also had a reading Steiner incident, which means somehow some world lines are changing somehow. But he's also not remembering. Is it that he's not remembering that he called her back, or is it that the AI is misremembering? I don't know. This, this could get deep here. We got some rabbit holes starting. I forgot her name is. That's her last name? 
Well, I... Don't uh, be embarrassed. Sure. Otherwise, this wouldn't have happened. She never would have opened up to you as quickly as she has. Hmm. Is the AI Karisu also so, secretive? how close were you? Was she your lover or something sweet like that? Can't worry, that chance. Not in this world line. That's not it. This Karisu yeah, never even so. knew him. You already told me that much. Can't be the whole story. When's he gonna spill the beans to Maho about the time machine? And what everything that happened. I just I wanted to know that side of her. Yeah. It's a side I never saw. She wants to know everything. After all that time I spent with her, I feel like I don't know who she really was. I don't even know her favorite books or movies. I don't next to nothing. Just pieces. Thanks, guys. I'm glad you all stayed till the. Sorry, I can't. There's a guest coming to stay at her house tonight, and I have to be there. Tonight. We've got Ruka, the Seriously? the guy, They're to protect us. Christmas? Yeah, it's some guest of my father's. I do like this. Is really touching. Okay, it it. It's amazing how in this show, this this group of girls all like freely welcome this guy who's presenting differently into their group like effortlessly like they're all hanging out and like Ruka is a part of their like cosplay girl group even though he's a dude I just like how it's not even a question in their friendship that they'll include him um, that's really cool especially um, now that we know how Ruka feels and how much like he's hiding of his true feelings from Okabe and everybody else I just like that aspect of the show. Like it's it's a total non-issue. It's really cool. My dad really wants me to be there. I wish I could, Mayuri. Mm -hmm. It's been such a long time since everyone came to the lab. I had a what? I promise it's safe with me. I've been searching for someone. For who? A girl who traveled here in the time machine with me from the future. Thing is... You never mentioned that? It happened here in Akihabara in 1998. She said that? 1998? Uh, and the girl was 10 years old when they were separated. That would make her 22 now if she's still alive. Suzuha keeps saying she should move on. But whenever she's traveled through time, she picks up the search again. She was just about to give up the search for good, when she stumbled across this picture on the internet. When did she visit 1998? She never mentioned that. Like this. And Susan has been searching for this mystery kid on her own. What's the girl's name, anyway? She told you, right? It's Kagari Sheena. Oh, no! Sheena? Are you serious? Why did... Mayushi. Why did she bring a kid with her from the future? Was it basically just the only way to get her out of danger? That's Mayuri's kid. She brought her back to 1998. Why did she not keep a hold of her? How'd she lose her in 1998? Ah, oh, Suzaha, you screwed this up. If you were going to bring somebody extra back from the past, why'd you ditch her in another year? His daughter. But who's the father? No, no, no stop. stop. The, the girl's, girl's not her biological daughter. daughter. She's, She's a war orphan who Mayushi adopted, or will adopt in the future. future. Quite, Quite the development. development. According, According to Suzuma, in the year 2036, police groups called peacekeeping squads are after Mayushi and they have tried to develop a time machine. Damn! Just, Just forget about us! Mayushi was helping? The are closing in. You have to hurry! Suzuma! Take her with you! Oh. If that's what you want, I'll take her. No! Okay. They were just getting her out of danger. But it's dangerous to send people into the past. Especially someone uncontrollable like a kid. But then Suzuhu ditched her. How did she lose her in 1998? After that, Suzuhu went back in time. First she went to 1975, then 1998, and then 2010. They got separated from each other in 1998. 
Okay, well, I guess she never mentioned, because the other Suzuha, the one that actually told us all of the stops she took, was not this Suzuha. So I guess it is possible she went to 1998 and just, we hadn't known that yet, but how'd she lose her? This is crazy. Listen, Okari, you think you can help? We gotta find this girl. Look, I know it's a lot to ask, and you're still... All right, I'll help. You ditched Seriously? her in 1998, and now you're trying to find her 12 years later? Defected. Can civilians defect no. when you're not at war? I don't understand that term. I'm sorry. The AI know the real her was murdered? Is she aware of that? She hasn't mentioned it. The Y2K problem? Did you ever study that? At the institution. This knowledge was never made public, but the main culprit in that crisis was this computer, the IBM 5100. That's why I'm using this patch program, to make sure the Y2K problem never happens. But... She fixed Y2K as well? Why That's why she went to 1998? Is it okay to do that? Wouldn't it change the time that we... It's a line split point. It's something that we must... They did mention in um, the original Steins Gate series that certain events um, that are big enough affect world line shifts and they mentioned specifically the invention of the time machine in 2010 aka the phone wave and time leap devices they mentioned Y2K as one of them and that was also when Okabe got sick and gained reading Steiner it's because it was during a world line shift that kinda let that happen for him I think so this is weird. So Suzuha basically already created the timeline where Y2K is not a problem, which is all the known timelines that we know about in Steins Gate so far. It's due to reach Steins Gate. I intend to change the future. Change it on purpose? That's right. We can't let a world like the one we came from exist. I'll prevent that. She would never meet Mayuri then. Her parents would be alive. She would never get adopted. And that's that's what she's thinking about. Ah. This is sad because this is what Mayuri was always saying about the phone wave and the time leap machine. That if you go back and change the future, you change the past and change the future, what you experience never happened. And there's something like really bittersweet and sad about that. And she didn't agree with them changing things, especially when they tried to stop Suzuha from going. Uh, into the past, she she didn't agree with el eliminating the experiences that you had, and that's Susa. His mission basically is to change everything, which would include Mayuri's kid actually ever being adopted by Mayuri. So that's that's really tough, and the daughter feels the same way. It's kind of interesting parallel there. The kid have a little freak out, and then. No, what are you doing? You crazy kid. This kid is nuts. What? Gotta keep better control of your weapons, Susan. Huh? I don't want kids get it. What if I did supplementary research? No, then he'd have to give her the yeah, name, and that's not a good yeah. idea. The base of Amadeus resides on the server in the research facility at Victor Pondre University. I'm allowed to use the computers and network for whatever I want whenever I want. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do you need me to stay? They gave an AI network access? They gave her access to the internet and research databases? Does that mean... Oh, man. That just seems like a really bad idea. Ooh. Go and play Thomas Was Alone if you want a, a good feel-good game about AIs escaping their computer. Are the internet for evidence? Because I'm gay. Hey, what? Is that because my dad had a house guest and it's going to be more long-term than he thought. We're stocking up. They've mentioned this yeah. house guest a couple of times. It's pretty heavy. Do you need a hand? It seems no. like it could be important. They haven't shown us the person this. either. And I have been swinging my sword. Fairness, if you ever find yourself in trouble, don't sit around making a sad face, Comfy. Fair is kitty. I'll be all better. Ferris, 
has a lot of resources. Like she's, if you've watched the first series, you know, like she's uber rich. Her family like owns Akihabara, basically. She could really solve like a lot of their issues. I see. Like hiding the time machine. No leads on your end. No, sorry. Well, thank you. Mm. Professor Leskin. What's up with the professor? I'm I'm very suspicious of him at this point. I'm telling you, it's really okay to stop searching. He went in the dead end. No! Sure, we don't have any clues, but don't you think it's sure? What's up? Well, I am. Um, look, I really need to ask your advice about something, so are you available to meet in person right now? Right this minute? Yes. It's her! Someone is on their way over for a meeting. Can it wait until tonight? Unfortunately, it's urgent, so that won't work. Just tell him it's the girl you, he was looking for. Yeah, coming. coming. He described her to him, right? Damn! Daru doesn't know she's working for Rounders. Don't ask her to look for people. Ah. He knows that already. Ah. Nice. These cliffhangers are good. I don't know if I can watch more today, but I want to. Man. Wow. Okay. So... This is getting really good now. I'm getting excited because it's it's clear something is still going on with time travel, but now we're seeing it from the other side because Okabe and Gang aren't the ones doing it. So we're seeing what the experience of everyone else would be when someone's messing with time. We have no clue who. We have no clue what they're doing. We just know that Okabe is sensing it with the reading Steiner. This is getting deep. And what's the mission of... Mayuri's daughter, I'm forgetting her name, what they called her, but I don't know what's going on because she would know that the friends know Rukiko, so she's staying at the shrine on purpose. There's got to be a reason for that. I'm excited to know that. All right. I got to keep going. <laughs>